<laughs> I'm like, okay. We are not moving our hands, but we are moving our chest, <laughs> our mouth, <laughs> eyes. Okay, it's difficult. <laughs> foods but it's true that paella is one of the most famous yes. one also like the tapas oh yeah that is a, can be whatever jamon with cheese also i like a lot croquetas we put like bechamel and can be chicken jamon or also fish mm -hmm. inside uh, so you, you can like a mess and you fry them you it's not both with like in a long way oh we have something similar to for sure but i don't know i don't know how you call it we don't call it So we start with pizza, of course everyone knows pizza, pasta, and then... So people say pizza, they say pasta, but it's not a food, it's a, an ingredient for us. So mm. in, depending on what you put on that pasta, on what you put on that pizza, it's going to be a lot different. of your country <laughs> <laughs> oh my god okay okay wow okay why did you ask for food <laughs> okay 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 <laughs> oh, <really? Yeah. gasps> my gosh i have just to hold my hand especially if we speak spanish or italian mm. it, it's worse yeah it's because we are speaking in english right. that exactly. we are not using exactly. so many gestures exactly because it would be worse in our languages to that point that people say you don't need to know italian you can just use your hands and you can just communicate with people yeah but i think there is a big 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 difference between italian gestures mm. and spanish gestures normally i think spanish gestures are support oh, your yeah. talking so we do gestures like these or when you're counting like these or, you, or like this but the gestures I feel many of them they don't have like a real meaning but I have some Italian friends that they teach me gestures and they are or a sentence or a word oh, yeah. so that is very specific and it's amazing you don't have that kind of stuff in Spain not as much as in Italy yeah. I mean no it's another it's another language somehow I thought that Spanish and Italian are really similar I thought that also you had the hand gesture thing, but I didn't know. Like the bad gesture that, that is international. You don't have this? No. Oh. That is what I felt when they say to me, like, this is a sentence. It has a meaning. Yeah. It's like, what are you doing? What are you talking about? Yeah. yeah. This is like everywhere. There are people just talking in their own language and doing this and they're like, oh, I'm talking in Italian. No. <laughs> yeah, it's like pesto di pesto di pesto. Yeah. Like, what the hell are you saying? So if you use this, it means that the other person is saying something that makes no sense to you. Mm. So it's not a good meaning, actually. Oh yeah, this one, I don't care. I don't care. And then this is for yummy, but this is just for children. You children do it, and if it's adults, usually they just do. Mm. Mm. Or love it. Or, or, or mm, see, yummy. that's the difference. I cannot say to you exactly any Spanish gesture like that. Well, for example, like if you look at football players, they're always like to the judge, like, what are you saying? Come on, please. This no. is a mix between this and and pray, like, yeah, oh, God, kind of. oh my God, this is the big <laughs> one. Like, I am so tired. What are you doing, yeah. right? Like, I think in Spanish yeah. people, we have like more international gestures and the rest is like, we're, yeah, <laughs> support your talk. Nothing special, not as Italians, that is well known. Ah, oh, we have this one, like, talk to you later. See you ah, later. Yeah, also. This is, yeah, it's not this one. This is, this if is you are crazy, crazy, this is crazy. But this one is like, see you later. If you are angry with someone and you don't want to make scene in front of other people, you're like, but same goes, like, for example, you have a friend you want to meet on another place, then you're like, especially like, if, for example, there is a guy or a girl that you like, and you're like, <laughs> I know another one. Ah, uh, are you scared? 
Are you scared? Yeah, but why you do that? I don't know. You don't know? Oh. <laughs> Maybe my friend was wrong, but they told me. This is because when you are afraid, huh? your body is in tension, right? Yeah. It's like yeah. your butt. Yeah, it's like. Oh, uh, really? Yeah, so it's like. Didn't know that. Well, I don't know. Maybe it's wrong. It can be. It can be. It can, it be. can be. No. Well, in Spain, I think is not considered as polite. Person that makes many gestures is quite vulgar. So my mom always say to me, "Be quiet with your hands. Stop. Why are you moving your hands so much?" She's more elegant than me. <laughs> in very formal situations, you have to control a little bit your gestures. I think it depends on what kind of hand gestures it is. For example, of course, if you are doing something that it's like this in front of a judge in the court, if you are in the court and you're like this, it's not going to help you. <laughs> yeah, in front of the police. But still, like we use hands a lot. So, for example when I am explaining something in front of people it's much better to use your hands so for example if you're having a meeting or a seminar many people use their hands for that reason because it helps what you're saying yeah more impact and people yeah. can memorize exactly. better yeah. but you don't do this you don't do some gestures that can be offensive for people listening to you on the other hand when I was in elementary school they teach you how to use hands when you talk you should use your hands so when I was a kid of course I wasn't using my hands and when I looked at my dad he was always talking like this and I'm like I will never become like that look at me <laughs> this is the only thing that can help yeah you. yeah otherwise after seriously after two minutes you forget yeah yeah you know that there is a saying that if you tie an Italian person hands that person is going to die <gasps> Because they cannot use this, so they are so much like this. Oh my god, I need to talk with my hands. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah, I've been to Spain twice. I'm already trying to move my hands. <laughs> and I've been to. <laughs> okay, 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 I'm going to put it here. I went to the southern part for one week with my school yeah. when I was in high school. Which part? Granada? I went to Granada, I went to Cordoba, I went to Sevilla. Wow, yeah. so it was really, really cities nice. of the south. I really what liked it, but like the food is really, really good. People are really, really welcoming. Oh, they are very open, yeah. yeah. And there are so many beautiful palaces, like the one in, um, in the Alhambra one. Oh, yeah. That one was really, really pretty. Another time I went to Barcelona, mm. but that time I just stayed there for, I think, two days and one night. Mm. So I, just, I couldn't see much. Mm. I want to go back to Spain, if I can. Mm. Did you feel that monuments uh, are so different oh, yeah, from they are, Italy? They are a mixture of Arabic mm. and Christian side style. <laughs> I'm like, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so I really liked it. Like, it's exotic to us. We are not moving our hands, but we are moving our chest, <laughs> our mouth, <laughs> eyes. Okay, it's difficult. <laughs> yeah, I visit also Sardinia. Ooh, like, I've never been to Sardinia. Yeah, it's, it's quite different. It's an island, so it was feeling like my home too because it's very similar to Mallorca. And I just make like a very, very fast trip to Milano. Ah. I couldn't see so much about Milano, but really and about the beach. Sea is so pretty, food is so amazing. And I mean, they put big quantities of food. How people can eat that much? It's I don't think Italian people eat a lot. Uh, no, actually, Italian people, they are very really thin. That is amazing. It's like, it's like how you can eat pizza like four weeks. Because we don't eat pizza that often. We I don't eat pizza know. once a month. Oh, really? Oh. And also, for like, example, for eating out. Outside. Oh, okay. <laughs> We're eating outside. <laughs> we don't eat outside that often. So hard. Um, but we are connected. Uh, so yeah, like, we are connected. I, I can feel. Okay. Oh, 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 finally, finally, finally. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's do all the gestures well, that we can now. I can say like we can speak without using our hands, but it doesn't feel the same. Like yeah, it's, it's like, like really, really boring. <laughs>
Mm. There is no passion. Yeah, no passion, no right. trying to connect with the person mm. you're talking with. Yeah, and in this case, we were holding our hands. <laughs> so I was feeling exactly what she was feeling, like yes. because you know, like the vibration, but I think it would be very cold if we are just yeah. like in front of each other or in a date mm. or something, and you are like, yeah. Oh. Mm. yeah. It looks like you're not you interested. A reporter for the news, oh. you know? Hello, today yeah. we are going to talk about people. No. So serious. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think it's the first time I tried to speak without using my hands. Yeah, me too. <laughs> so today we talked about hand gestures in Italy and in Spain. If you like the video, please press like, subscribe and leave a comment. We'll see you soon. Bye! Bye.